Campbell River, the third largest city on Vancouver Island. It has so much to offer. Named the micro city of the future by Foreign Direct Investment Magazine, Campbell River receives global recognition for a wide range of lifestyle pursuits and opportunities. In the long run, Campbell River will be the next major center north of Nanaimo, a hub for tourism, for industry, for services. Over the last year, dramatic changes in the forest sector have occurred at the same time that Campbell River has had the highest number of building permits in recent history. Clearly, these are changing economic times. We need to consider what changes would enhance the attributes of our community for current and for future residents. What opportunities are there to diversify the local economy? Two ideas have come forward from the community. Both involve new recreation infrastructure. One indoor facility, the Downtown Events Centre, and one outdoor facility complex, the Rob Ron Park Improvements. The Downtown Events Centre will be the showcase in Campbell River for spectator events. At present, there isn't a location in Campbell River that can host a major indoor event. Where in the city would a promoter bring a large music or stage event? Where would special shows set up in the winter season? Where are there facilities for the lights, sound and action that would establish Campbell River as a centre for large entertainment, cultural or trade show events? The event centre will suit these needs and will make thousands of customers return often to downtown Campbell River, supporting restaurants, hotels, and the other businesses in the downtown core. Under the dry floor is an NHL-sized ice sheet, suitable for BCGL or other hockey events. 2,500 fixed seats overlook the action. Private suites are available to raise funds through corporate or organization sponsorships. From outside, the Downtown Events Centre should be an architectural icon in the downtown, a stimulus to community pride and adjacent private investment. On the inside of the Events Centre, the key is flexible space, including a lobby with natural light, spaces for concession, a concourse designed for safe movement and informal displays for social and festival uses. Basic to the Events Centre are five skate change rooms team change rooms and storage, but the building would also likely include multi-purpose rooms to allow smaller meetings or community activities. Parts of the event center may be designed for complementary uses, like a restaurant and lounge that overlooks the event floor, or areas for lease to appropriate tenants. The preferred location for the event center is in the immediate downtown core, where it will maximize economic impact and downtown revitalization. The proposed outdoor recreation infrastructure will be focused on improvements to Rob Ron Park and adjacent school grounds. This outdoor sports center will be the key place to hold tournaments year round, even after the heavy rain events that normally close all outdoor sports fields in Campbell River. Rubron Park will host the first artificial turf field in the city. With proper drainage and lighting, artificial turf can be programmed for intensive use, accommodating more users more often than grass alternatives. A synthetic track around the artificial turf field provides a facility that will be the center of track and field events in Campbell River. Adjacent bleachers will take advantage of the slope site and the magnificent views of the sports and the island mountains. On adjacent school district property, two new ball diamonds and a grass field surface will be built. At the park, an outdoor lacrosse box will provide multi-purpose paved space for spring training and for other court sports. Expanded parking, new playground, and a central field house location round out the new complex. This will be a key outdoor sports facility in Campbell River. It will build community pride 
and economics through sports tournaments and related sports tourism. Most importantly, it will support community spirit and health for all ages, providing a recreation and activity venue for the entire Campbell River family. Beyond the health, culture, and community benefits of the two facilities, there are economic development reasons to proceed. Both the Downtown Events Centre and the Rob Ron Park improvements will bring sports and cultural tourism to Campbell River. Both facilities will make Campbell River competitive in attracting citizens, visitors, and economic growth. With a potential economic downturn, Construction of these facilities could fill a gap in jobs. Total capital budgets for the two facilities add up to approximately $52 million. The city is asking for voter support to borrow up to $20 million. Approximate annual cost of this borrowing is $64 per $100,000 of assessed property value. The city will not finance these facilities on its own. It expects two-thirds of the investment to come from senior governments, from private partners, or local organizations. There are good chances for cost-sharing from the federal and provincial governments to diversify the local economy. Council has opted to test overall public support for the proposal before taking the next steps. On November 15th, please vote in the recreation referendum. Do the benefits outweigh the costs? Tell us whether this is the right priority at the right time to show our pride and confidence in the future of Campbell River. <laughs>